It is known the list of weapons for Ukraine in its spring offensive. Lloyd Austin, the Minister of Defense of the USA, stated that the members of the contact group for the defense of Ukraine are united and filled with determination to continue supporting Ukraine and believe in Ukraine's success during the spring offensive. Lloyd Austin at the press conference following the meeting of the contact group for the defense of Ukraine in Brussels told it, We see that the Russian Federation is deploying new troops on the battlefield. What Ukraine wants to do right now is to set conditions at the front in its favor. We expect Russia's new offensive in the spring. This is why, together with our partners from the contact group, we are working tirelessly so that Ukraine has the advantage in armored vehicles in order to produce a desirable effect at the front. Austin added that he believes that Ukraine will be able to show initiative and create favorable conditions for itself. We demonstrated with our joint efforts that we are eager to support Ukraine and its independence for as long as needed. We will continue taking decisive measures, Austin assured the public. He stated that at the beginning of February, the US announced another military aid package for Ukraine, particularly HIMARS systems and shells for it, anti-tank shells. In addition to this, the U.S. allocated $1.75 billion for strengthening the defense capacity of Ukraine. Austin emphasized that Ukraine's allies will continue to make efforts to supply Ukraine with everything it needs. This is why we discussed the synchronization of our efforts. The head of the Pentagon reported that the members of the contact group have made a decision to supply Ukraine with the Bradley and Abrams tanks from the US, the Challenger tanks from Great Britain, modernized tanks, tanks from the US, the Netherlands and the Czech Republic, and the T-72 tanks from Poland. Military aid also includes important steps from Canada, Germany, Spain, Norway, Denmark, the Netherlands, Poland, and Portugal concerning the supply of Leopard tanks. We heard about the supply of powerful air defense systems. France and Italy will jointly supply Ukraine with an air defense system. France also announced its cooperation with Australia in the production of the 155 caliber shells. Austin remarked that for him and his colleagues, the guarantee of supplied weapons being used as intended and measures that prevent the spread of arms are a priority. He added that the members of the contact group are united and filled with determination to continue working in order to guarantee Ukraine's security.